power that in the hands of an irresponsible driver can kill. that on the other hand can be of great service when controlled by those who are careful and considerate. Each morning as the sun rises, a great green fleet, thousands of telephone cars leave garages all over the country to provide more and better telephone service. Driving these cars is serious business, and as the number of cars increase and traffic conditions become worse, the drivers bear an ever-increasing responsibility for the safety of themselves and others. Today, throughout the country, 90 people will lose their lives in automobile accidents. Will they be anyone you know? While you are looking at this picture, one will die and three will be crippled for life. It happened yesterday too, and the day before. It will happen tomorrow, the next day, and the next. Why? Oh, they give lots of reasons. One says, I had the right of way. Another, he went through a red light. Or, he didn't signal. That's what they say, but actually, they didn't see. They didn't hear. They didn't think. It's human failures, not mechanical failures, that cause most accidents. A vehicle is designed for your safety and convenience. With regular inspection and proper maintenance, it's ready to take you safely wherever you wish under all kinds of weather and highway conditions. But don't forget the most important factor of all, the driver behind the wheel. For it's the driver who determines whether accidents have to happen. Look at this. Do things like this have to happen? Let's see where and how most of our accidents occur. At intersections. On curves. By bumper chasing. at parking spaces. And here's another common occurrence. When Joe left his truck, there was nothing behind it. It could have been a lot worse, Joe. And here's another. Tom has parked his truck on a grade. As he starts his first job, Tom's car goes on to the next job without him. accident traps waiting for you. Can we avoid them?